The accusations of an assault and a cover up surrounding the leading candidate in the governor's race. And tonight we're hearing two very different stories about what happened in a Vegas parking garage between the congressman and the cocktail waitress. Anita Vogel live tonight in our West Coast newsroom. Anita. Trace less than two weeks to go now before the November election, and the leading candidate in the Nevada governor's race is finding himself in the middle of a scandal that could wound him going into the final stretch. 32 year old cocktail waitress Christy Mazeo claims that she bumped into Congressman Jim Gibbons and his aides at a Las Vegas restaurant one night, and that after having drinks with the group, he attacked and assaulted her in the parking garage. She dropped the charges because, she says, a friend who was with her that night warned her against making trouble. A warning Mazeo claims came from the Gibbons campaign. Well, I thought it was going to go away. That's my intention. That's why I, I signed the paperwork for it to, to drop charges. That's, I thought it was going to go away. I didn't think my name was going to be released to the public. Gibbon says the whole thing is a flat-out lie. He claims he walked Mazeo to her car, she stumbled, and he grabbed her arm to prevent her from falling. I have the truth on my side in this issue. And I'm, I'm firmly believe that I did nothing improper either at the restaurant or after the restaurant or any time thereafter. And as if a sex scandal weren't enough, Congressman Gibbons and his wife are being criticized for hiring an illegal immigrant nanny some time ago. This is a woman who claims she was told to stay in the basement when company came calling. Trace, back Anita to you. Vogel, live.